learned about our ocean. It keeps so flashy. Woo 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 woo. And this is my world. Hey, Juju. Look at what we got. Yay! We need a passport. We got a new package of little passports in the mail. This one is stamped and it says Oceans. So I think it's going to be about oceans. We also brought her introductory kit and inside is her map just in case we need to use it for some reason. Ready to open it? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. Let's check what's inside. And let's open this. Oh, what's this? Ooh. Oh. Is that everything? Okay. Let's see. Mommy, look it. Let's see what it says. No. This one. Okay, so this is just a little card saying what you get if your age is five to eight. You can get this little science junior kit for a little passport. Let's open this one. There we go. Here we go. Let's open this. Oh, there we go. Oh, here we go. Wow, what did you get? Oh, look at it. A sticker. A sticker, and look at this is another thing that you can put on your suitcase, right? Yeah. Do you know what animal that is? Um, a king. Yeah, so she got this little tag that says oceans and then on the other side it's a jellyfish so we can add that to her suitcase. What else did you get JJ? You got stickers? Okay, and then well, let's read through here. <gasps> Show them what you got. You got another postcard. Let's read it. Okay, let's read it. So here's the picture, here's the postcard that she got and it says Great Barrier Reef, Australia. The Great Barrier Reef is the largest coral reef system in the world. We saw so many type, different types of fish and coral when we went scuba diving. So you got a postcard from your friends. What is he looking? That's from, that's Max, Mia, and Toby. So we got this. It says use this map as a guide to place your stickers on your wall map. Oh, okay. You see these stickers that we got, Juju? Yeah. We're going to have to put them somewhere on our map. Do you want to try that? Yeah. Okay, let's try that and then we can continue to open all of the things. Okay. So, let's get our map out. And to, um, let's read it. Oh my goodness, that's so big. I, I need them. Here, let's put it here so they can see it. Okay, Juju, so we have these stickers that you're going to be placing on the map somewhere, okay? This first one here, these are icebergs. And icebergs go in the Southern Ocean. So the Southern Ocean yeah. is all the way down here. It's kind of right here. So we have to put one of these stickers of the icebergs in the ocean. Can you do that? Yeah. Let's put it in the ocean because it's freezing. It's freezing? Yeah. Okay. It looks like a, a tent. It looks like a tent? It's yeah. A, it's a mountain of ice. But it's like a tent of ice. Oops. Oops. Let's this. Yeah. Good job. All right. The next one we have are lobsters. So lobsters go in the Atlantic Ocean. So mommy, yeah, you remember I saw um that in the other uh, restaurant? Oh, <laughs> in Red Lobster? <laughs> yeah, there are there are lobsters in the Red Lobster tank, huh? Yeah. Okay, so lobsters go in Atlantic Ocean. Can you put the lobster in the Atlantic Ocean? Good job. Is that place? That's the Atlantic Ocean. It's crawling. It's, it's like a real life. Yeah. The next one we have are conch shells. Do you remember who uses that shell? Mermaid! 
And who else uses it? What movie uses it? Moana. Moana. Yeah, Moana has conch shells. Conch shells go in the Pacific Ocean. But you know what Moana was a baby and picking up? Oh yeah, Moana picked up the little shell, huh? The conch shell. Yeah, it was with her baby. Yes. Okay, put the conch shell. Good job. Okay. The last sticker that we have is, you know what that is? Dolphin. No, it's a whale. Whale, it looks like a dolphin. It's a killer whale. Yeah, it looks like a dolphin. Kind of, but these are much bigger okay. than dolphins. Yeah. So this one goes in the Arctic Ocean. Where's the Arctic? Let's look for the Arctic Ocean. I think it's all the way at the top here. There, Arctic Ocean. But the fence will be tired why would the fence um be tired walking all the way here? I think they, since they're so big, they can swim a really far distance. Because you can see them in a lot of the oceans, not just the Arctic Ocean. You can find them in the Pacific Ocean too. Yeah. But they they swim in big families. Yeah. You know that? Yeah. Okay, so good job, Juju. So we put all of the stickers in here, right? Okay. Okay, so let's open the next. Okay. Looks like we got another activity book. Remember your other activity book that you did? Yeah. We can do this together too. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. Look at what it says. So there's little science experiments on here that you can do. Oh. We can try this later. What is um, the doggy saying? What is Toby saying? So you, we get these little cards and they have little facts about different parts of the ocean. And Toby says, emperor penguin. Look at Juju, these are penguins. And they're located in the Southern Ocean. The Southern Ocean surrounds Antarctica and it's home to emperor penguins. Toby wishes he could swim as quickly as the penguins. And Mia says, humpback whales are in the Indian Ocean. Humpback whales travel in groups called pods. Some pods rarely leave the Indian Ocean. Humpback whales sing songs to each other. Can you sing like a whale? Is that what a whale sounds like? And then it says Mia hopes to hear them sing. Mia wants to hear the humpback whale sing. So Max sang. Coral reefs are in the Pacific Ocean. Coral reefs like the New Caledonia Barrier Reef can be found in the Pacific Ocean. It says Max would love to go scuba diving there someday. So Max wants to go scuba diving in the Pacific Ocean. And look at this. And this one, just a picture of them. And then the ocean and all of the animals. And what Mia's hair is um, a blowy rain. Maybe, there, maybe it was windy. No, it was like one. Oh, she's running. Okay. And then this one says the Earth has five oceans. Oh, I didn't know they had five oceans. Yeah, it's like five oceans. Is there a new ocean? <laughs> I thought there was four oceans. I got me. Okay. I got so, uh, the Earth has five oceans: the Pacific, Atlantic, Arctic, Indian, and Southern. I guess the Southern is a new one, unless it was always five. Daddy, yeah. are there four or five oceans? In the year 2000, the Southern Ocean was proposed. Okay, so I just learned that when I was in school, we only learned about four oceans, but as of 2000, they added the Southern Ocean. So that's something new. Mommy learned something new too from the kids. <laughs> Wait, is your teacher as mad as you? And then we say, ah, la, la, la. <laughs> oh, let's clap. Whoa. Where did you get it? I got it. What does it say? It says fishing instructions. It's like it comes with sea creatures, ocean creatures, and then a fishing pole. So let me open this and then you can fish, okay? Is the table? Yeah. So the table is, is it kind of the ocean? Yes, so you can pretend that the table is the ocean. What's this animal? Turtle. Turtle. 
I'm gonna hand it to you and then you can put them where you wanna fish, okay? Okay. What animal is this? Fish. Okay, go ahead and put it on the surface so you can fish. No, I'll, I'll put it right here. Okay, and what animal is this? Um, octopus. Octopus, good job. And they're going to next to her best friend. That's it. That's her best friend. Yeah, that's her boyfriend. That's her boyfriend. How do you know the octopus is a girl? Because the octopus got eyelashes. Look. <laughs> <laughs> well, boys and girls have eyelashes, Juju. <laughs> what animal is this? Starfish. Starfish. But it looks like a star on the air. Oh, it looks. In the, in the sky? They look like the stars in the sky? Sky, star, sky, star. <laughs> <laughs> and how about this one? Do you know what animal this is? Um, a crab. Um, is this one a crab? Or no, a that's monster? a crab. Oh, okay, so which one is this one? Monster. Not a monster. Um, a lobster. A lobster. <laughs> it looks like or maybe that's a crab. I don't know. No, this is a crab. I think this is a lobster. That's a crab, look it. Huh? It's a crab. <laughs> okay, I don't know which one. One of these is a crab and I think one's a lobster. <laughs> the one is a crab. Okay, so go put that one. <gasps> you caught one! Here, let's put it on the side. Catch all of them, okay? No, this is her ocean. Oh, you want to put her back in the ocean? Is that her home? Okay. Let's get the fifth one. Which one are you going to try to catch next? That one. I want to catch it. You got it. I will put it right here. Oopsie. Oh. Okay. So you're catching them and releasing them? We're not releasing. You're putting it back in the ocean. So remember how we were saying in her little activity book that it had a experiment? So we're actually going to try the experiment because we had all of the things that were needed. It's pretty simple. So this is called salt water science. It says the ocean water is very salty. Salty water is different from fresh water. Do this experiment with an adult to learn more about salt water. Okay, Juju, so tell us the things that we needed. So we're going, so the piece of water with glass and salt. And what else did we have over there? We got eggs, they're really cool and wet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the first thing, so we already filled our glasses with tap water and then it says for this we're going to call this one on the, on the right side fresh water, okay? Because we're not going to add the salt to this one. So what does it say? It says gently lower an egg into the water. Okay. Doing this one? Yeah, do it very carefully. Oh, try it in this one. Okay. It's ice so cold. So none of our glasses have salt in it. I don't know why it's floating. <laughs> <laughs> it's not supposed to float. It's supposed to sink. Rotten egg. That's a rotten egg? Yeah. The oh. egg floats. <gasps> so we just learned that. <laughs> so we haven't used these eggs for a while. And we just learned and looked up that if your egg floats in regular water, that's not a good thing. So it's kind of halfway sinking, floating, so it's probably not edible, so we're gonna have to throw away all these eggs after, right? We need to throw away? Yeah, we gotta throw them away after. Because look it, it's not really sinking all the way down, so it's not good. So we need to, we need to use these two? Yeah, but oh. see, so if you have good eggs, what it's supposed to do is, if it's just in tap water, it sinks all the way to the bottom. Um, so for the second glass that we have here, we're going to mimic what the ocean is like, and oceans have very salty water, so why don't you put that salt in there? Wow, look at all that salt. 
A lot of mist? Yeah. Okay, and then you put the second egg in there. Let's see if it floats right away or if it sinks. Is it floating or sinking? No, no, okay, float. So it's floating. It floated quickly, right? See how it just comes all the way back up? Yeah. So objects float more easily in salt water than in fresh water. When you add an egg to your glass full of fresh water, the egg sinks, if you have good eggs. When you add an egg to your glass full of salt water, the egg floats. You see how this one is floating more than this one? Yeah, because we put salt in there. Yeah. Juju, you you? what did you learn today? I learned about the oceans, and I learned about sinking eggs and floating eggs. Uh-huh. And? I learned about the sea animals. Yeah. We also learned how many oceans there are. How many oceans are there? Five. 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 <laughs> five. 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 Yes, there are five oceans. I can't wait for my next little passport. I wonder why I get. Bye. See you next time. Thank you for watching Do This Live Egg World. Be sure to like.